Since Fortnite Chapter 2, I've been having a problem with my mouse alignment in the Fortnite menu. You can see here that my mouse isn't properly aligning up with the change and play buttons. And even though I'm over change, it's selecting play, and I can select the change button when I'm hovering above it. This is known as mouse offset, and it can make it annoying to navigate the Fortnite menu. But I found the solution, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix your mouse alignment problem if you're having the same issue. The first thing you need to do is make sure your window mode is set to full screen in Fortnite. You can do this by selecting your Fortnite menu, then go into settings, and then under the display settings, you want your window mode set to full screen. You see, when you use windowed full screen or the windowed mode, this can cause mouse alignment problems. Another thing is you want your resolution set to 1920 by 1080 or 16.9 or whatever your monitor is using, but 1920 by 1080 is what's going to suit most people. This will hopefully solve your problem straight away. However, if you're set to full screen like me and you're still having this problem, here's what you need to do next. For this next section, you're gonna to wanna to close Fortnite and exit to your desktop. Now you're looking for the game user settings file. The game user settings file is something that anyone that's used a stretch resolution before is going to be familiar with. But if you haven't used a stretch resolution or you're not sure where this file is anymore, here's what you need to do. You wanna to go to your search and type in percentage sign, app data, percentage sign, and then click the file folder. Then you wanna go back a level by clicking app data and now select local. Here you're looking for Fortnite game and you can press F on your keyboard to sort to F to make it easier to find. Now you wanna to go to saved and then config and then Windows client and here you'll see the game user settings file. Double click it to open it in notepad. Now you wanna scroll down until you see the resolution settings. You can use control F to search and make it easier to find. Once you're here, these are the settings you're looking for, the resolution size X and Y, and last user confirmed resolution size X and Y. These should be set to 1920 and 1080 respectively, if that's the resolution your monitor is and what you want to use in Fortnite. You can see, however, that my X is set to 1920, but my Y is set to 1040. Therefore, I'm 40 pixels out, and that explains why I need to hover over the buttons in order to press it. So, I need to change my Y to 1080. But, to edit the game user settings file, you're going to have to make it not read-only. To do this, go back to the game user settings file, right-click it, and select properties, and in the attributes section, and in the attributes section, you want to uncheck read only and then click apply and okay. Reopen the file, find the resolution settings and change them back. Then you can close it and just hit save. Once you've changed the resolution settings and you have them what you want, make sure you change it back to read only by right clicking it, go into properties and recheck in this box. The problem that I had was I left it off read only because I edited my resolution one time. That made the problem whenever I would set Fortnite to windowed mode to drag it on to my second monitor and it would always change the resolution so I would keep having this mouse alignment problem but changing it to 19 by 20 and 1080 in my game user settings file and setting it back to read only fix my problem. Now, the next time you load a Fortnite, it'll be in a desired resolution, and hopefully this has fixed your problem. But if you're still having problems, it could be because your display resolution is set to something different than what you're using in Fortnite and the game user settings file. So here's what you need to do for that if you're using an NVIDIA graphics card. Go to your desktop and then right click anywhere where it's free and select the NVIDIA control panel. In the display section, Go to change resolution and you want to make sure it's set to 1920 by 1080 or whatever resolution you're using in the game user settings file if you're using a stretched resolution. Then you just want to save this and close it. I don't have an AMD graphics card, but if you do, then follow these steps. Open your AMD Radeon settings, set the scaling mode to full panel. In the custom resolution section, click create. Change the horizontal resolution and H timing display to 1920 or whatever X resolution you desire and change your vertical resolution to, and V timing display to 1080 or whatever vertical resolution you want to use. Then save your resolution. Once you've done either of these steps, so the NVIDIA or the AMD graphics card, you now need to check your display resolution in Windows. 
To do this, just right click on your desktop and choose display settings. You wanna just scroll down until you find the scale and layout and your display resolution should be set to 1920 by 1080. And then you can just save this and close it down. Now, the next time you load up Fortnite, any problems with your mouse alignment should be solved. As you can see here, mine is now properly aligning up with all of the buttons. I hope this video has helped you fix your mouse alignment or mouse offset problem. And if it has, make sure you leave a like and subscribe to my channel and turn on post notifications. So when I release more videos, you get notified. And if you're still having problems with your cursor alignment, please leave a comment below and I will try to help you out. Anyway, that's the end of this video. Thank you for watching and have a great day. Peace.